Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel, it's Jo here, I hope you're all well. If you're new here, I'm Jo, I do craft videos as well as Poundland hauls and charity shop finds and any other bits and bobs that I pick up on my travels around my village or off the internet. So welcome, I hope you enjoy and you stick around for a while and for those that are returning, thank you always always thank you for your continued support you know it means the world to me i tell you all the time and yeah today's video is a little bit unexpected i actually hit 3500 subscribers over the weekend and i'm absolutely over the moon i was hoping to do it before christmas and i have done so for today's video i've got a poundland haul and everything that's in the poundland haul i'm going to be giving away to one lucky winner which i will talk about more later on in the video so yeah everything i'm gonna pop in a box and send to one person and hopefully they'll get it before christmas and yeah we'll get into what i picked up before we start i've got a quick shout out and it is for josie at fashion mumbler she does vlogs she's doing vlogmas at the moment and i've been watching every single day i really look forward to sitting down in the evening and watching her videos she lives in the cotswolds she's a uk based youtube and she's got the most stunning house it's absolutely gorgeous and she's got two sweet little dogs and yeah she's just really really nice and really sweet and she's always a pleasure to watch so she's trying to get to 500,000 subscribers so if you've not seen any of her videos I would highly recommend checking her out jumping on over to her channel subscribing and helping her out so yeah we'll get into what I picked up from Poundland so the first thing I picked up was the signature range and this is the rich creamy fudge in the clotted cream and this is gluten free and I just thought this would be a really nice little thing to add to the box and then to match it I got exactly the same but this is the sea salt version I am going to be going back and buying some more of these for myself the boxes look so nice and they look really expensive I can't believe these were only a pound so I'm going to go back and get these two for myself as well this I think they did have another one I'm not 100% sure what the other flavor was but the clotted cream and the sea salt I thought would be really nice so there are them two and then I had to add my favorite chocolate which I love to eat over Christmas and this is one of the Terry's chocolate oranges and yeah I can eat one of these within like 10 minutes I absolutely love these they're really really nice with a hot chocolate with marshmallows and whipped cream and I need to pick up some more of these for myself I haven't had one this year and I'm really looking forward to having one I need to go to Asda in a bit and get some shopping so I think I'm going to pick myself one up for later on tonight again with a hot chocolate chocolate so that will be also in the box of course I had to add my favorite perfume and this is the black dusk I have about six boxes of this myself I love this stuff it is a dupe for black opium I've always mentioned this in my Poundland videos whenever I buy a box I just know that eventually they're going to stop selling it and I'm not going to be able to get hold of it but yeah I wanted to make sure that I've got a supply so of course I had to add this in if you haven't smelled this I would highly recommend it it smells divine I just absolutely love this and I wear it every single day and then picked up one of the beautiful scrumptious body butters and this is in the aloe vera they did have another one but I can't remember what the other scent was I picked up the aloe vera one because aloe vera is really good for your skin I haven't tried this but I've got a feeling this is going to be really good if you have tried this and it is any good can you let me know in the comments and I think I'm going to pick up another one of these for myself you just add this to the skin once you get out of the bath and I can imagine it smells really nice I have like I said I haven't opened any of this stuff so I don't know what it smells like but I'm going to go and get another one for myself definitely next we have a scrubber dub dub hemp exfoliating three-piece set and it comes like this it's got a hand mitten and then it's got the two pads one a larger one and a smaller one and everything that i'm going to put in this box is like a bit of a treat so pampering or a bit of makeup a bit of chocolate things like that the reason i didn't do a craft one is because there's a lot of viewers that watch my videos that don't do crafting so i wanted to make sure that this would be all right for everyone 
one so i thought this would be quite sweet and i think if anybody's doing any hampers again any pampering hampers or anything like this i think this would be a really nice thing to add into their hamper I bought three of these, one each, and we'll start with this one. This is the limited edition pink cactus sheet mask. Now, I don't use face masks or anything like that. I have really sensitive skin, so I keep my skincare quite simple. I use Dove soap. That's all I use on my face and a bit of moisturizer and makeup wipes. That's the only thing that I use on my face other than makeup. Um, so I never really use anything like this, but this is the Pink Cactus Sheet Mask. It's with Pickly Prayer Extract and Pro Vitamin B5. It smooths and nourishes the skin whilst helping to reduce the appearance of fine lines. So I don't know if these are any good. I think it looked really, really nice. You pop it on for 20 minutes, you wash your face, put the mask on 20 minutes and then you take it off and it's supposed to be really nice and soft. So that's also in the box. And then these two I haven't tried, but I'm going to go back and get some for myself. This is the Deep Moisturising Tea Tree and Peppermint Foot Pack. And this is enriched with tea tree, peppermint and vitamin E to deeply moisturise the skin, helping to smooth and soften dry, rough and cracked heels. And it comes like this. And yeah, I would like to try these out. So it's got vitamin E in it for deep moisturising. Fully rewash and dry your feet, take out the unfolded boots and use scissors to cut the top of the boots open and then you just put your foot in it and leave it on for 15 to 20 minutes um, and massage any, any residue lotion into your feet. So I'm not too sure again if these are any good. I remember everybody going on about the Poundland feet, um, feet peel ones that they had. I think it was last year. Was it last year? Yeah, it was last year. Um, and everybody showing pictures of their feet peeling. I don't think that does this. I think this is just a moisturising boot. So that would be quite fun to give it a go. And then this one is the Deep Moisturising Shea Butter Hand Pack. And this is a enriched with shea butter, vitamin E and Moroccan argan oil to deeply moisturise the skin, helping to smooth hands and nourish nails. And I think, again, this would be a really nice one. I've never used anything like this on my hands, so I'm quite eager to give it a go and i will definitely be picking another one of these up when i go in poundland and again you just put the gloves on you leave them on for 15 to 20 minutes and then rub any of the excess cream into your hands and it should soften it up i bought some fake nails these are the 24 false nails with a glue and i thought these were really nice and simple i have my own nails i don't wear fake nails but um i used to when i was younger and yeah they're really 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 good and they just add a little bit something if you want to have nice nails and you can't make it to have them done so they will be going in and then i also picked up some of the daytime false eyelashes and this is two pairs now i'm not too sure if you get the eyelash glue in it it doesn't say um, it doesn't say anywhere on it if you get the eyelash glue or not, but I've never wore fake eyelashes. I'm going to give them a go next year. I'm just really worried about gluing my eyes together. And I know that you put the glue on, let it go tacky and then add it on. Um, so at some point I think I'm going to try some, but I just thought they were super sweet to add into the box also. I picked up two nail varnishes in some nice colours. I got the, so this is the Makeup Gallery Time to Shine Quick Dry Nail Varnish. I buy these all the time and use them. And if you use them with the base coat and top coat, they'll last a lot longer. Um, they, they last quite a while, um, better than some of the more expensive nail varnishes, but you need to use the base coat and the top coat to make them last. And this is in the colour Vintage Pink. And then I also picked up a darker red for over Christmas because it's such a Christmas colour. And this is the Blood Red. And this is number 18. And this is number 9. And I just thought they were really nice, sweet colours. A lot of people who wear nail varnish don't like wearing bright colours. So I thought these would be quite a nice neutral colour for anybody who gets the box. 
I picked up some of the hand cream and this is the orange cream orange crush hand cream I don't know what this smells like I haven't used any of obviously I've not opened anything or smell anything I don't know what it smells like but this was seen on Britain's Next Top Model apparently and it's just a nice little hand cream that you can pop in your handbag and I thought the packaging was really sweet and yeah you just pop this on and I've noticed that I've been using a lot more hand cream now that I've been using hand sanitizers every time I go in and out of a shop so yeah it's just ideal to have in your handbag and I will smell this next time I go in Poundland and if I like the smell of it I'm going to pick some up for myself I normally just use the Never Here Soft but they didn't have any in Poundland and I'm running out so I think I might see what this smells like and then try this. I then picked this up and again I've never tried this. This is the number six limited edition shimmer body lotion and it comes in a bottle like this and this moisturizes and conditions leaving skin with an illuminating radiant glow and obviously it's got gold glittering. I'm not too sure how shiny you'll be after using this but I just thought it was really nice and now that obviously we're coming up to Christmas if you wanted a bit of a glow I just thought it'd be really nice for somebody. I'm not too sure how you use it so I suppose you just add it to your skin after you get out of the bath and yeah you'll have a radiance glow so i'm eager to see how this goes i think i will pick up one of these and try it um next time i'm in poundland and yeah we'll see how this works out but i just thought it'd be a really nice sweet little idea and like i said so you give it a little bit of sparkle over christmas this was the last thing that I bought yesterday, but there is some more stuff that I'm going to be adding into the box. I've got some stuff from Body Care. I've got a few bits that I picked up from Poundland at the beginning of the year that I haven't used that I'm going to add in. And then I've got a couple of other bits that I'm also going to add in as well. But the last thing that I bought yesterday, this is the OG Outdoor Girl Eyeliner Duo Pack. And this is in the blackest black, so I wonder how black it actually will be. But the reason I bought this was because I also bought some eyeshadows from Body Care and I thought that this would finish off a nice eye look. And the eyeshadow that I bought, and because it's Christmas and it's glittery, this is the Sun Kissed Glitter Galaxy Eyeshadow Palette Intensely Pigmented Pressed Powders. And yeah, this is absolutely stunning i love the green and i love the gold i think it would be so nice for christmas and yeah with really intense black eyeliner it would really make it pop so that's going in and then to finish off a look i picked up a nude lipstick well it's like a darkish darkish brownish color and this is the body collection england it's sealed so i can't open it to show you but you can kind of see what color it is there and then the last thing I picked up from Body Care was this little nail set. I thought this was super sweet and it's Paris related. So you know me, anything Paris related, I absolutely fall in love with straight away. I think I'm going to go back and get one of these myself. It was £1.49, but it comes in this little case and it's got the sweetest little flower pattern on the scissors and the nail clippers, the nail file, and it looks like a pair of tweezers as well. Super nice to have in your handbag and I just thought it was really nice and girly and I had to buy it so I could pop it, pop it in the gift box. I was in the card shop and while I was there I thought I would pick up a nice little diary for someone and this is the happy, Make It Happen diary and it's for 2021 and obviously it's just a day by day diary and I just thought somebody would enjoy just popping everything that they want to do in 2021. Hopefully things will calm down a little bit and you can start to make your plans. One of my favourite things to do just after Christmas is start to fill in my diary for the next year put in all my birthdays and all the things that I want to do and the places that I want to go and visit and things like that not that I ever get to do many of them because you know me and my health conditions 
um yeah i don't go out very often but it's nice to plan and if you don't do it then you can always add it on to the next year and it's something to look forward to so that is one of my favorite things to do just after christmas and i sit down i put something good on the tv i have a hot chocolate and yeah i just fill my diary so i'm looking forward to doing that after christmas then i've also got a, another couple of bits from poundland that i bought like i said at the beginning of the year and i haven't used and this is the three pack lip gloss and this is the matte finish i'm not going to use these i've got loads of different lip glosses so i'd rather pass these on to someone that would use them i don't know if they've done them again or if some poundlands still have these in we haven't got them anymore in my poundland but i just thought they were nice three little shades and yeah i just went through my bag of stuff that i bought and i thought i would pop these in then there's this eyeshadow palette and this is from manhattan amazing nudes eyeshadow palette and again this is from poundland it's never been used and i'll just open it so you can see the shades but these are the shades that are in it and it's in the makeup section where you get the different brands makeup next to the poundland stuff they had these and i just thought this would be really sweet as well um so yeah and then also again something that i wouldn't use this is a cuticle pusher and nail file and it just comes like this again you can just add it to your handbag and it's always there whenever you need it and then the last thing that i've got a while ago i bought a box from a auction house and i always forget that i've got these they're in the hallway um, in one of the drawers but I remembered that I had some and it came with about 10 little bookmarks they're all brand new they were $1.99 I'm not too sure where they're from and it's a little house bookmark and it's on a old little ruler and I just thought it was really really sweet so I thought I would pop that in the box also so that's everything that's going in the box and like i said it's going to go to one lucky person hopefully before christmas so we'll get into the giveaway rules the first thing is that you need to be over 18 i will need your address when i contact the winner i will give you my email address and then you can send me your address and i can get it in the post to you I would like it if you were subscribed to my channel. Obviously, it is a subscriber giveaway and I'm trying to grow my little channel and yeah, it would really, really help me out. Also, I would love it if you would share the video either on Facebook or Twitter or with your family and friends. I've said that you need to be over 18. The closing date for the giveaway is going to be Wednesday the 16th at two o'clock in the afternoon. And the reason for that is I will be doing the draw in Wednesday video that goes live at half past six so i want to make sure that i can get it filmed and get it up and ready in time the other thing is that at the moment this is only going to be open to people in the uk obviously i'm uk based and the weight of this is going to be really expensive to send it internationally so it is only uk based um subscribers that will be able to enter I will be doing a lot more giveaways next year that will be international so there'll be some exciting videos coming up hopefully at the middle of next year but I am going to be doing a lot more giveaways especially some of my craft stuff as I'm running out of space to keep things so I will be giving a lot of stuff away. I've got loads of ideas for videos for next year. I'm really excited to see where my channel's going to go. And if you've got any ideas for any videos that you would like to see, please leave a comment. And to enter the giveaway, all I ask is that you leave a comment, be a subscriber, share the video, and I will reply to your comment letting you know that you are entered into the draw and for a chance to win all these goodies so i hope you've enjoyed the video guys again thank you so much like i said i knew that i was hoping to hit 3500 subscribers before christmas i did it and here's the video to say thank you so i hope everybody is well i hope everybody is having a lovely weekend or oh, had a lovely weekend i'm actually filming this on sunday so for me it's still the weekend but for you you'll be watching this on monday evening so i hope you all had a wonderful weekend and i will see you 
on Wednesday for my next craft video the results of this giveaway and then I've got a little vlog that I'm going to be doing on Thursday and I'm going to take you around the charity shop so till then take care love you guys loads and I'll see you all soon bye for now